Here is another question one of our viewers had. They wanted to know how to calculate the space between the steps. And I don't really know if they're talking about the space or the measurement between the top of the upper step and the top of the lower step, or the top of the lower step and the bottom of the upper step. But either way, I'm going to provide you with both ways to figure it out. And of course, if the stairs are already built, you can just simply measure the distance you need. However, I don't think that's the question they're asking because that would be too simple. So the first thing you're going to need to do if you don't have the set of stairs will be to get the measurement for the total stair rise. And that's going to be the measurement between the lower level and the upper level. And in this example here, we have four foot eight inches. And if we convert this measurement to inches, we're going to have 56 inches. And to find the individual riser height, you can always divide the stair rise by by a few numbers until you find an individual riser height that is acceptable by you and your local building codes. And in this example here, we're going to have a riser height of seven inches in between the top of the lower step and the top of the upper step. And this would be the first way to calculate the difference between the steps. The second way will simply be to deduct the thickness of the stair tread from the overall riser height. So if I have a stair tread that's two and a half inches thick, I'm going to end up with a space between the bottom of the upper step and the top of the lower step of four and a half inches. And that should be true all the way up to the top until you reach a surface to where you won't have a gap between the top and lower step. And thanks for watching. If you enjoyed the video, let us know by hitting the thumbs up button or letting us know in the comment area.